Hey guys, what's up? It's Noah and in this video, I'm going to be going over all the different tools and softwares that I use for selling on Amazon, regardless if that's for drop shipping or if it's actually for sending in bulk to Amazon's warehouse. So this is just going to be a very quick video showing you all the different tools that I use personally in my business. Now the first tool is called DS Amazon Quick View. Now in order to get it, you would just go to Google and you would type this in and basically you would just go to this page, you would download it for Google Chrome and this is the free extension. And what this tool allows you to do, so here for the example, I just searched up Apple Watch Band and you'll see underneath all of the listings, there is now this box. And what this tool allows you to do is you can very quickly see the sales rank, you can see if it's FBA or FBM, and you can also quickly grab the ASIN. So this way, if you need to go into the back end in order to list it, you don't need to open up a new tab. And this saves you so much time. This basically cuts down your Amazon product research in half. And also, in addition to that, it allows you to go ahead and you can hover over a listing and it allows you to see the reviews. It also allows you to go ahead and see the ASIN and the customer reviews, the amount. So this is just crucial information that now you don't actually need to go ahead and open up a new tab for it. You can just see all this preliminary information from the very first page and you can do this for every single item. So you'll see that it's going to pop up for every single item and I can very quickly tell which item is selling well. I can see the sales rank and like I said, best of all, I can go ahead and I can grab the ASIN very quickly. So the second tool that I use in my business is one of the most helpful tools that I've ever found for Amazon, as well as I think it's one of the most heavily promoted tools. And this is called Keepa. Now you might've heard of it. They used to be free, but now they actually charge 15 euros a month. But the best part about it is that you don't need the extended version. You don't need the paid version. So like I said, you get to see a lot of information with DS Amazon quick view, but you don't get to see everything. So if you wanted Keepa and what it does is you can go to a listing. So let's say I'm going to click on this and you'll see that Keepa is going to pop up on the bottom. And this is going to give me so much information that is going to allow me to see if this product is actually worth purchasing and if it's actually worth sending into Amazon. Now, right now I'm on the free version just to show you what you would get, but you would basically be able to see where the price is hovering. You would be able to see warehouse deals. You'd be able to see the used price. And what this does is it allows you to actually see the price history. So let's say that you can get an item and you can get it for $15, but on Amazon, it's selling for 35 there. You actually might make a profit, but if you had this tool, you might see that in the past, it actually was selling for $20. So what this allows you to do is it allows you to tr keep track of all the different price history to know if that price is going to fluctuate and if it might go down or up in the near future. Another very cool feature is that you can actually go ahead and check the sales rank. You can also go ahead and keep track of all of this different data. And another thing is that you can actually see the product on eBay. So what it will do is it'll take the UPC code from Amazon and it'll search it on eBay. So you can see how well this item is selling on eBay just to see if maybe you should also sell it there. You can also go ahead and see the variations and track the product as well as it also shows you the different quantity. So if you click into how many sellers are actually selling it and you were to actually, this product doesn't have any sellers, but what you would do is you would find a product and if it had multiple sellers, Keepa would estimate how much inventory they actually have. Now, since we're on the free version, we don't actually have access to the Keepa graph and we're not going to be able to see the sales rank, which is honestly very important when you're an Amazon seller. So the way that I get access to free sales rank graphs is I use a software called Scan Unlimited. So what Scan Unlimited does is this is actually a price sheet scanner. So if you have a price sheet from your wholesaler, you would just upload that to Scan Unlimited and it would find all the products on the price sheet and it would match the UPC codes with the ones on Amazon and it would find all the Amazon listings. This way it could tell you the sales rank. It could tell you how many sellers are on it. It could tell you the price that it's selling for. It could also match that up with the price on the actual price sheet and it could tell you how much profit or how much ROI you are going to get on your investment. Now, this is mostly a paid software, but they do have a free plan where you can upload about one price sheet every single month, and that's going to be on the free plan. So if you work with very few wholesalers or you have like less than 12 price sheets, you can use this software entirely for free. Now, the reason that I said that I like to use Scan Unlimited in tandem with Keepa is because when you're using the free version of Keepa, you don't have access to the actual sales rank graph. And that's one of the most important things when it comes to Keepa. So once you scan a price sheet on Scan Unlimited, it brings up all the item information and it also shows you the sales rank. So you'll see the sales rank right now. You'll get to see the 30 day average, the 90 day average and the 180 day average, as well as it also shows you the Keepa graph. So we can use this in tandem with the free version of Keepa that we got for Amazon. And these tools working together are definitely very beneficial, not only if you're drop shipping, but more so if you are actually doing wholesale and sending that inventory to Amazon's warehouse. So besides for the sales rank, it also shows you how many sellers, it shows you if they're FBA or FBM, 
and it also shows you how many ratings they have and also the rating percentage. It shows you the prices. It shows you the variations if they have it. And they also have a built-in calculator. So before this, I was using a software called RevSeller. Now RevSeller does cost something. I forgot the price of it, but that would actually be a calculator that would pop up on the Amazon screen. And you can go ahead and you can just see your profit right on Amazon. But for this, Right now when I'm actually scanning a price sheet, I have all the information for the item and I can go and I can see based off of the price that I'm going to be paying plus the FBA fees, which they estimate, I can then see if it's going to be or it might be profitable for me or if I shouldn't actually source this item. So this is why Scan Unlimited is a very good tool to use, especially if you're doing wholesale on Amazon. And like I said, they do have a free version that you can use. Now, the second to last software that I do use in my business is Jungle Scout. Now, I use the paid for Chrome extension. This cost me $97 and I really could not run my business without this. So the reason that I say that is because before I was using it, I was estimating the sales and I was using a bunch of different softwares. For me, this is the most accurate that I found. So let me just show you really quick. When you're on an item page, you can open up uh, Jungle Scout and it will show you a lot of information. So the very first thing that you're going to see that is one of the most important things is it shows you the estimated monthly sales. Now I've tried different softwares like Viral Launch, Helium 10. I found that Jungle Scout is the most accurate. So what this allows me to do is when I'm doing product research for wholesale or even drop shipping, I could see how many times a unit is selling or I could see how many times a listing is selling. And this is really good information because not only does it show you that the listing is making sales, but it also allows you to see how many units you need to order. So if you see that it's making 60 sales a month, then you can order about 70 or 80 units. And this way, you know how many units you're going to need and you don't overspend or you don't underspend and you don't get too little units. The second reason why I bought Jungle Scout and why I think it's a great software is because it shows the brand. Now, this might not seem that important, but this is very important, especially when you're drop shipping and also when you're researching wholesalers using the Amazon competitor method. So for example, if I was on Amazon and I was doing some product research, maybe I had found this brand called Ohio Wholesale. Maybe I found them on Google and now I'm trying to see if their products are actually selling on Amazon. What I could initially do is I could go ahead and I can use the software DS Amazon Quick View to see the sales rank. Looks very good. Also, like I said before, I could just use Jungle Scout. So I can go and I could see how many units each one is selling a month. But also I'm gonna show you how you can use the brand section to go ahead and find other wholesalers to start working with. So now it's going to run on all the listings and then it's going to show me all the monthly sales or the estimated monthly sales for each listing. So this unit right here is selling about 2,700 units every single month. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open that and it's going to open up in another tab on Amazon. And what I could do is since this one has seven sellers, I'm gonna to go to each seller. So we're going to see which seller is selling this listing. Now bear with me because I'm going to show you how I use this to find other wholesalers. So what I wanna do is I wanna to go to one of my competitors. Since I wanna sell Ohio Wholesale, I'm gonna to go to all of their products. I'm gonna to go to their listing page. So I'm gonna click products and that's going to bring me up all of the different products that they sell on Amazon. And then what I can do is I can just click Jungle Scout and Jungle Scout is going to then go ahead and run all the different listings. And it's also going to show me which brand or which brand of products that this seller is selling. So you'll see right here that we just scanned all of the listings that the seller is selling and they are selling Ohio Wholesale. So that was the one that we had originally found, but now we see that they have Capri Blue. They also have Intellex. They also have Dickies, they have other different brands. And what I could do is I can just highlight this and then I can open this up in Google and I can just see if I can go ahead and find this brand. And it looks like I found their website. And what I wanna do is I wanna see if I could go ahead and find their source and see if I could find their supplier for these items. So now I have other items that I can go and I can sell on Amazon. The last tool that I use in my business is I use Amazon's FBA calculator. The reason that I like to use this calculator is because it's directly from Amazon. You could just put in the listing information and they already have all the different fees for this product. Now, what I would do is I just go on Google, I type in FBA calculator and I click that and then it brings up Amazon's own calculator. And what you can do is let's say you're researching a unit since we have DS Amazon quick view and we can see all the different ASINs right away. We're just going to copy this. We're going to copy it and we're going to paste it right here. And then from there, Amazon is going to bring up all of the fees and it's going to be an FBA calculator. So we're going to select the unit and now we can see how profitable it will be. So let's say that we wanted to sell it for $99 and ship to Amazon is going to be a dollar and then product cost is $25. This is completely random, but just to show you an example is that Amazon already knows the fees for this product. They already have all of this information 
because other sellers have sent this in to Seller Central or sent it into the Amazon warehouse. So we already see the fees. It's going to cost us $15.85. And then to Amazon Fulfillment is going to be $4.83. So this is why I use this calculator, just because I feel like this is the most accurate. And this is another tool that I do use in my business. So thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, be sure to go ahead and smash the like button. Also subscribe to the channel if you're new. I make weekly content about drop shipping on eBay and Amazon using wholesale suppliers. Like I said, these are the exact tools that I use in my business. No affiliate links. These are the tools that I use to make sure that I'm profitable and that I'm maximizing the time that I use for in my business. So I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. Also, I hope that you download the tools and that it's able to help you in your business. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.